The T is a really tricky letter in English. It's perhaps the consonant that has the most variation in pronunciation. And there are many occasions when the T is silent in spoken English. As always, I'm going to talk about what happens in American English. You may hear something different in other dialects of English. Now, T's are often silent after an N. Here are some common words where the T is usually not pronounced. Center. International. Interview. Internet. Printer. 20. Winner. Atlanta. Percentage. Entertainment. Fantasy. Accounting. Identification. Now, in more careful speech, however, you may sometimes still hear the T pronounced. But in a lot of normal speech, it's silent in many words after an N. Now, beware of ST spellings in the middle of words. You'll notice that the T is silent, specifically in words ending in S-T-E-N, S-T-L-E, and F-T-E-N. Here are some examples. Listen and fasten. And there are a few others, but you're not likely to use them. Words like moisten, they're not really that common. Now here are the S-T-L-E words. But again, there aren't a lot of really common ones, but you hear a few. Like castle, wrestle, and whistle. And by the way, you may be wondering about the T in often. Standard American pronunciation has the T as silent. But British pronunciation pronounces the T. They say often. And many native speakers are also confused by this, so you may sometimes hear Americans say often as well. But the standard American pronunciation is actually often. And there's one more really, really common oddball word that has a silent T after the S, and that's Christmas. Don't pronounce that T. It's Christmas. We also have some silent T's in words that were borrowed from French. The common ones include ballet, gourmet, rapport, and mortgage. And finally, a T may also be silent when it's found between two other consonants, like in the words investment, mostly, exactly, and bankruptcy. But again, this is optional. You may hear people also pronounce that T in there in more formal, polished speech. So that's a lot of silent T's. I hope that helps shed some light on this tricky letter. Can you think of any other words that have a silent T that I haven't mentioned here? If so, please write them in the comments. Thanks for watching.